Hello everybody once again coming to you from the 2022 Florida RV Super Show in Tampa, Florida. Um, what is it today? Today, Industry Day edition. It's been a long day. It hasn't been a long day. It's just me. Ember, Ember Recreational Vehicles here. I, I've, I haven't seen him before. So let's take a quick look at them. They, they seem rugged uh, travel trailers like, uh, you know, for off-roading. All of them single axle. And uh, true mount board, that's always a good sign. Um, here we have one of these griddles that are all the craze these days. Uh, on a um, on the tray there that presumably goes in and out and uh, let's step inside this one this is ember 123 warranty i don't know exactly what model number it is but uh here we go one thing to note look at this skylight here in the front it's uh i really like that uh, and then of course you can open it up and put your black screen or I mean, if the, if the light bothers you, let's say you're camping in Alaska in June and it never gets dark, you know, you can black out pretty good. We have some storage up here. This is a Murphy bed unit. I'm not going to try to bring it down, but I'm sure you just, you know, do the sofa, you know, very similar to ours, make the sofa a flat surface and boom, the Murphy bed comes down. I like the fact that you have USBs and um, power on this side and USB and power on that side too very nice round um, uh, sink here one thing I don't you know this material I don't know uh, how well this will fare, will fare with prolonged exposure to water ask me how I know but hey may, maybe maybe they're doing some kind of coating that it, it protects it but in any case here we have this two burner actually that kind of becomes like a splash guard back there I like that um, I haven't seen this gray stone uh, two burner uh, 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 propane stove, but I've seen that gray stone as uh, I've seen the griddles. So this is very cool. Of course, here this sofa here is kind of awkward. You you you're sitting in front of your refrigerator, but, but the TV is there in front of the recliners here, so that would work. Now um, here is uh, actually I like the the way that the the wood looks. It's, it's, it's got the Dometic 12-volt um, uh, 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 refrigerator, which is a, a good refrigerator um, if you had the batteries to run it. And uh, here in the bathroom, of course, hey, what do you know, porcelain toilet. And it's, uh, it's very nice, actually. It's not bad. We've had a fantastic fan. Or is that a Max here? Yeah, one of the two. And let's step in the shower. The shower here. I'm not crazy about this black color, but I'm sure that could be changed. Yeah, ample room. As you know, I'm 5'10", and there's no problem, no problem. Mechanical switches, which is also, also refreshing to see. You know, all, uh, lately all RVs all have that uh, multiplex wiring. This is nice, nice wardrobe closet. Lots of storage, which is always a good thing. Look at that. Look at that cavernous space down there and pretty long drawers. No slide on these ones. This is also good if you want to uh, do more of the uh, adventure lifestyle. This one, you have the ad uh, outside kitchen there. This one too. Of course, it is industry day, so we don't really have any data sh sheets. Usually outside they have, you know, with, with weight, uh, especially on a trailer, it's very important to know weight it's, it's, it's see if you if you have the tow capacity to tow it this one has this very large capital griddle but look at i don't know i don't know exactly how to it's probably a two-hand operation oh no it, there we go look at that huge griddle ah you can make breakfast for six in there a small uh, compressor refrigerator on the outside to keep your beer and, and whatnot okay he, here's how the bed looks when it is in the in the murphy down position very nice Huge skylight. This one has a TV here, which is kind of, it's not exactly in front of your sofa, but sometimes you have to make compromises. And of course you can swivel. This will swivel and, and become almost in front of you. This Fury, it looks like it has a built-in uh, sound bar. Same galley, same materials generally. This one has this uh, with a table. And uh, here we have bunk beds on this side. That's the, that's the main difference about this, this, this model here. 
Yeah, porcelain toilet is always good, but it's, I, I um, this type of material that is basically particle board inside, I don't, I don't, I don't generally trust it in an RV uh, because you know water will uh, in, undoubtedly accumulate here, and, it, and I think it's only a matter of time uh, before it starts warping or whatnot. I could be wrong. I could be totally wrong. I like, I like this. Uh, by the way, it's here. Same deal. We have USBs down there all over the place let's take a look at this very small unit here which is probably perfect for for the outdoor lifestyle and camping and you have the outdoor kitchen here with a with a roof over your head you know just in case it starts raining at least you can you can do something out here it's, we have that the large domestic freezer and i'm sure here you could put a outdoor kitchen or whatnot i like the look of having the spare tire there uh, on the side of the rig well this one seems to be occupied inside but uh, yeah it's basically a step up from a, from a from a tent there's someone in there let me see oh here we have the propane well let's take a look at this one there's no one inside this one and um, that's Illy by the way <laughs> um, and this one yeah it's uh, of course this is very ow oh I hit my head they should definitely put a sign here, you know. Watch your head. Uh, maybe after you hit your head three or four times, you won't you won't do that anymore. Oh, that hurt. Ow. Well, here, you know, very basic. You have your sofa that becomes a, a, a bed. You have this uh, air conditioner here, fantastic vent, and um, table where you can work or eat or or whatnot. And um, of, of course, no, no. I don't think there's a any facilities in this one like no well that you can reach the storage on that side from here and here is just uh you know plumbing and you know this is a perfect location to put one of those like uh, pool noodles is that what you call them so you don't hit your head oh that hurt that still hurts <laughs> let's uh let's go around this is the propane here this one is locked, so it's probably the batteries. And here's just that storage that we accessed from the inside. That's that, that Truma, uh, this is the, the Truma Combi, or that, that may be the, the Vario Furnace, actually. That's the Vario Furnace. And, uh, and here, yes, that's, again, another one of those. And, uh, and this is a Camco a freezer. Okay, these are cool, let's see. Let's take a look at one more of this. This one or this one? We haven't done this one yet, right? Ember. A little bit of storage here in the front, by the way. Okay, I like I like their 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 sense of humor. Warning, use common sense. <laughs> and this one here, it's uh actually it's a very similar floor plan to Mini Tini One. Very mini tiny one and mini tiny two actually, because you enter through the back. You have your galley here on this side. Of course, this one has a sofa. I mean, it, it, it was oh, this one has a small slide out actually. That's why it feels so so roomy in here. Of course, your skylight, nice bed uh, here. Is this also a Murphy bed? I, I believe this is a permanent bed here. Yeah, and then you have access to some storage down there. TV large drawers not very deep kind of shallow but very large drawers and your galley here very nice and you know most of the time all you need is two burners and uh, this is a very good utilization of space because you have some prep room here which is very important of course um and there i mean i've seen far worse so I, I'm, I'm not gonna criticize them much but um yeah, I kind of like it. Let's see the bathroom. I like the fact that they're using uh, porcelain toilets. That's one of one one thing that I like. And the mirror is rather large, so if, if you are uh, vertically challenged, you can still see yourself in the mirror. That's a good thing. I like this shower. Let's see if it passes the shower test. Oh, plenty. If you are six six two six three, you'll be very happy. And they even. Uh, did a, 
um, toilet paper holder. By the way, no oven of any kind whatsoever. You get a, a, a Furium microwave, smallish Furium microwave, and that's it. No oven at all. Nice, relatively deep pantry. More storage up there. Everybody's using this, these types of lights fixtures. I don't think there's any power in here. In any case, that's it. That's it for Ember. Uh, recreational vehicles here at the Florida RV Super Show 2022. And I'll see you in the next one.